A little girl gunned down in a drive-by shooting would have turned seven years old today. And tonight, Angel Hooper's mom is speaking for the first time since her daughter's death. KMB Tonight's Haley Harrison has that mother's emotional story. Well, it's clear to see that little Angel Hooper has not been forgotten. She was gunned down outside of this 7-Eleven store back in October. And you can see this pile of toys that just keeps growing and growing. But there was another group of people today who were doing their part to remember her. They gathered today at her grave site, which is not far from here, and really marked today's somber occasion together. Happy birthday. To you. Wait a minute. There were no Happy candles birthday. or presents. Yeah, she was beautiful, beautiful, pretty, beautiful Happy little birthday, angel. <laughs> angel Hooper would have turned seven Thursday. Happy birthday. At her graveside. Balloons ready to deliver I love yous from those who miss her most. It's hard being that it's the first time I've been out here since. Um, the burial. The grieving mother admits she didn't want to be here. It's hard. Um, that's all I can say is it's hard. I don't really have any words. Every day is a struggle, but they keep going. We miss her. We miss her a lot. Her family isn't alone in their heartache. Each Sunday, they march with McCole Stewart's loved ones. We're so used to street violence. It, you know, the, the people's almost numb to it. The 10 year old was killed in another drive by shooting at her grandma's KCK home days after Angel's death. Woo! Families marking bitter milestones and still saying goodbyes. You no, know, if Angel was standing here, she'd just be a dancer, wouldn't she? New investigators believe that McCole Stewart's murder may be linked to other crimes across the metro. The reward for information leading to an arrest in that case now stands at $7,000. If you have information that could help, you are urged to call the Crime Stoppers Tip Hotline. That number is 816 474 TIPS. Reporting live, Haley Harrison, KNBC 9 News. Two men were charged last month in Angel Hooper's death. They are Howard Chase and Leandre Smith. Both are set to make court appearances Monday morning.